So we have so many amazing local artists here in Arizona, and the team behind Moaza is joining us today to talk a little bit about how they're helping showcase some of these amazing local artists. So we have William and Joanne here with us today. Thank you both for being here. But William, I want to start here with you and talk sure. a little bit about what you guys are and just kind of give us the overview, because it's a really, really cool concept. So right now we are a digital museum, so we're online. You can go to moaza.org, M-O-A-Z-A.org. Um, right now we're featuring a 50-year retrospective of an Arizona artist named Ann Coe. She's actually a fourth generation Arizona. Wow. And so sort of the long-term vision is that we want to celebrate uh, Arizona artists past, present, and future. So um, cool. it's going to be a place where you can learn about Arizona artists, you can see their uh, works on display, there'll be a sculpture garden. And so the reason why we're digital now is because we're hoping to take over the Carnegie Library in downtown Phoenix, nice. okay. uh, which is actually owned by the city. And there's a whole bunch of machinations that would have <laughs> to happen first, but uh, it's, it's Lane Fallow for the last yeah. 20 years and it's a beautiful uh, red brick building that was built yeah. in 1908 nice. and so we're hoping to have you know educational programs connect with the underserved community the mm -hmm. light rail is going to go right down the capitol mall so it's yeah. going to go right, right by there. the front door so if, if your viewers want to see the building it's between washington and jefferson between 11th and 12th Avenue. and what a perfect space because it's like it sounds to me like it's a very historical space yeah, very so to bring so. all of this in there yeah, it sounds very fitting for the, yeah. yeah and, and when we have to also mention too that arizona and not just here in phoenix but just across our state have well-renowned artists mm. uh, that live here, work here, and, and love being here. And that's what also, too, is important with this new uh, museum. Yeah, the artist community in, in Arizona is very close-knit, and we, we're very intent about it being a statewide thing. Not a Phoenix thing, not a Maricopa County thing. You know, it's the Museum of Arizona Artists. So we expect, you know, representing the Navajo Nation and, you know, all of our various, um, you know, tribes and, mm -hmm. and people from all backgrounds, you know, all it's ages, really all cool. styles of art. Yeah. And, and what I love, too, and, and, and this is what's really nice, too, it's not just about our western art and that's where joanne comes in it's about our west our, our landscape our desert landscape because sometimes when we think of arizona artists we see the cowboy artists we you know see the navajo artists but right. we also have joanne here who does our landscape art mm -hmm. was beautiful and we, we have, have some so of your work many, down yeah, here beautiful yeah examples so tell us a little about some of the work that we see down here of yours well i like to go out into the landscape and paint um plein air and this is a sample of one of my plein air paintings from Poestua, Piestua Peak. Mm. Um, this one here? And then, yes, and then I take that information and I go into my studio and I paint a much more imaginative, surreal works that use that information as I work. I love it. This oh, is amazing. Very cool. Beautiful. Yeah, it's so beautiful. So. Yeah, I could see any one of these being up in a museum, being up for people to come and enjoy. And so I think. Um, Brad, you were going to try your hand at some art, yeah, right? So this, that was, I was like, oh, doing? Joanne, uh, you, you teach people. She goes, no, I don't teach people. I'm like, well, you're going to try to teach me. But what you're doing is, yeah, you're demonstrating. But also when they come to talk to you, artists, you do say everybody has an art uh, love in their heart yes. somewhere. And they can do this. It's just their perception of what they see out there. Mm -hmm. And that's kind of like what you, you're telling people. So you're going to let me be a part that's of right. your artwork here, what I love. Okay. okay. So what do we have here? Well, we have a, a setup uh, painting which is a background for the foreground. And the foreground is going to include some cactus. Okay. So I thought we could do a cactus. I could demonstrate to you how you might start. I've mixed up some color here. And, and what type of paint is it? Because I know there's oil, there's acrylic. This is oil. This is oil. Okay, is yeah. that what usually you work with? That's what I almost always work with. Although I do, other, I do everything, yeah. but this is what I mostly work with. I love it. Okay. All right, because so. I find it much easier, actually. All right. So here's a, a cactus. That's it. We're done. The awesome. I can do it. I can do that. So. I'm going to do this one big. Now you could do another one or two in the background. I love it. So this is pretty. So we'd have a. Well, that's what I was going to say. With the cactuses, we know that we see them with the arms on them. But sure. also they, they, they grow the arms later, right? Yeah. They start with the, it takes about 80 years to grow a cat, just the straight part. Wow. And then after 80 years, they start building their arms. Okay. So, all right. I'm going to give it a try so, here. And you're left hand, okay. which is very. I'm left hand. I'm going to show you that. Oh, I stopped shaking. Oh, show you that <laughs> you're going to want light on one side and shadow on the other. That's oh, I like do the main. Oh, I got what you're doing. I thought I was yeah. just going to do a little line. Look well, at that. Well, it starts with the line. And you're going to trust me. Okay. It's all, it's fine. It's all, okay. All right, let no me give worries. It, all right, let me give it a try. <laughs> okay, there. All right, here we go. 
And Lexi, just so you know, if she's trusting me to do her painting, you can trust me with your child. Um, <laughs> let's see how this cactus turns out. Not right. as precious right. as a child. All right, so grab a little here, and yeah. then just, and is it a smaller one? Is that what I'm doing? Yeah, do one, because it it'd be starting down. Down here? Further away, so it's for, think of it as further away, so it's smaller, smaller. and it's starting behind. All right, so I'm going to do down yeah. here and end it right about here. Yeah. Oh, but it's also, uh, so, like that? Yeah. But you're supposed to keep one straight line? One straight line and then give it a, an arm or two. At okay, least so one I'm going to give it an arm. <laughs> so, and just kind of like, is that the arm? Yep, that's, that's okay. So I'm going to give it another arm. It's just, one of those crazy whoops. wide arms. Yeah. How's that? <laughs> Okay. How's that? <laughs> Wait, right, well, okay, Brad. No, let's, no, let's, let's take a, let's take a just, look at this here. Up the paint. You can correct no, that, can't you? No, it's fine. Everything's so is, correctable. All right, all right. I'm going to put this, this down. Is this is for you why, to play with. Is it, okay, good. This is why they don't, don't trust worry. me with stuff. I see producer everybody coming to sell us to wrap this up. You know, Man, this Brad, is, it's pretty good. Is I'm, it? I'm impressed. Yeah, That's no, pretty not good at all. Thank you. You know, we need shadows under it, but, you know, that could be another time. Joanne, where can they find your pieces right now? Well, I have a website, joannelowney.com. Okay. And they can um, find it. And, and yeah. they're for sale too? They will be for sale. They are for sale on the website. Yeah. I love it. Mm -hmm. And then what okay. about for Moaza? Do you guys have a, way, uh, a place people can go? Moaza is M O A Z A dot org. Perfect. Perfect. Awesome. Perfect. Well, I thank love you for joining us. This is awesome. And thank well, you for Well, maybe they'll be hanging some of a... your art in there someday. Yes. Brad, yeah, well, down at Carnegie, <laughs> Carnegie Hall. Yes, yeah, we'll see. <laughs> thank you two for joining us. Yes, yeah, right. I'm going to try to finish this up here. Finish it up. Please work some more on it.